Welcome to the World Supporter Team. We are going to discuss Twitter for censoring and shadow banning conservatives. Our first case that we will discuss is a guy named Meerkat Yitz. He saw Dane use vulgar language to our president, President Donald Trump, and responded word for word to this Dane, the same exact tweet he had sent, and was then suspended. While this Dane, not only wasn't he suspended, he stayed with his blue badge. Once I started tweeting about it, he blocked me. said, you wanted a summary of my suspension lockouts. Locked for posting a joke picture. I didn't tag anyone, but some woman who didn't like me reported it. Suspended for sarcastically saying a woman who had been harassing me had Tourette's. Got an email saying it was a permanent suspension. I appealed twice. They overturned saying it was a mistake, and they were sorry for any inconvenience. Suspended for seven days for tweeting a committee underscore IR. I mentioned that they stone women and various other ignominious things that Iran does to people. My guess is that's what got me suspended. Suspended for defending myself against a guy who asked me from four different accounts. I called him stupid and an ignoramus. These were deemed suspension-worthy words. The countless accounts have called Ivanka, the daughter of President Trump, words that no one should call a woman, and with no consequences. Locked for a tweet saying, anyone who doesn't have a toaster has obviously killed puppies. Sarcasm is dead, apparently. On February 25th, I was informed my account was permanently suspended for targeted harassment. After one month, I contacted the ADL and the ACLU. The ADL responded and told me they would investigate. About a week after, the ACLU responded and said I didn't meet a broad enough segment of the population for them to get involved. I started protesting my suspension to Twitter repeatedly and kept getting different answers until one day they advised me what tweet did it, which was a quote from the movie G.I. Jane. I responded that I really get suspended for quoting the most female empowerment movie quote of all time, and my account was restored April 7th. I got suspended for 12 hours for saying Hillary was fighting for the right to vivisect innocence and speculating on how Cecile Richards could sleep at night. I also feel as if I got shadow banned a few weeks ago when instead of the 400 to 300 interactions with my tweets, I usually see I was down to four or five for a couple of days in a row. The account at Mandy Wax was first restricted for no reason, after no warning, no emails. After a couple of days of being restricted, it was suspended. Also, with no warning, no emails, no response to emails sent to Twitter. It was my original account, Road Beer, that was suspended for using the GIF I told you about. Then another of my accounts that was also suspended for telling someone to eat a Tide Pod when that Tide Pod challenge was going around. And about a dozen instances where I've been suspended for dumb things, and I've had four accounts permanently suspended in the last 18 months for similar issues. Ari Freeman was suspended for sending up the poll now. The famous candidate that was attacking Jews. As of today, it has been 152 days since Jack has suspended him. Please like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to share our video.